I have something to share with everyone today. Please. A very special breaking news. Okay. An exclusive here on uh, Super LA Noir Bros. Great. We're still cops. Yeah. Hey, yeah. Uh, As after all this, we're still we're still here. Still cops. We're still taking the world down. You're right. And right now, we are focusing on uh, investigating the one? print company. Yeah, we got it. Right. We've taken this all the way to the top. We broke open this stone well, so, car ring. Yeah, so let's this go. Could, this let, could this could be enough to get let's us out go, of. Let's go. Let's go to the Mar Marquee Printing Company. This could get us into homicide. <gasps> This could be the, this could be our big case. This could be it. I don't think it is. I think there's I, just I don't know. because don't, it's a don't get my hopes just because it's a DLC case. Don't, don't, don't get my hopes up, you know. Way. Little did she know her feminine charms were useless against the impenetrable Cole Phelps. <laughs> She's not my type. And what is your type, Phelps? I'm married. I know that. <laughs> You're not blind or dead inside, are you? Wait, scrap that second half of the question. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Blondes, I guess. Hallelujah! The man is human after all. <laughs> Now we're getting I like Bukowski. Yep. I'm with you Stefan Bukowski. Are fine too. And there's nothing wrong with a good bread. <laughs> but I draw the line at bread. <laughs> I might have to lift that embargo soon in the interest of maintaining a free market. <laughs> Man with high standards. The standards are only as high as the last glass of whiskey. Damn. Wow. Cops were way different back in the day. Yeah. Or were they? I say what they weren't. They weren't perfect dicks like us. <laughs> That's you love sure. the perfect dicks thing now. I, I get it. What have I created? The perfect... The perfect... Dicks. The perfect dicks. Got it. <laughs> what? Where am I going? Okay. <laughs> that was like a really long, like, silent driving segment. All right. What do you think it's going to be? Do you think it's going to be like the boss or do you think it's going to be like somebody else? I, I don't know. I, I feel like this yeah, is... It's, it's tough. I don't know. I feel like this is going to end in blood. I think this is going to end the marquee with printing company? No, I think I'm going to I think I'm going to find out something over here. I'm going to throw it in the face of whoever's at the warehouse and they're going to try and kill me. That's what I think is going to happen. I'm kind of with you on that. I don't like it. Nobody likes getting shot at. No one likes messing with the cops. But that's what it's like when you're a cop on the force. I'm a traffic detective from Central Division. Who's in charge here? I am, Gordon Lightball. What's this about? We understand that your company prints California vehicle titles. Are you going to take off? Yes, I have the government contract to print pink slips. I've done for some years. Have you had any goods or equipment stolen recently? We're running up against stolen cars with seemingly legitimate paperwork. Not recently. Uh, 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 have you ruled out forgery? There's no shortage of talent. Oh boy. Oh boy, we found something. <laughs> Let's talk it out. Should I? No clues, right? There's no music? I mean, maybe. I, uh, you know. Can we, like. No, there's not even anything. Anything? Like, check the desk, maybe? Can you go behind? <gasps> What's this? It would take a smarter man than me to connect that. Oh, damn it. God damn it. Alright. I'm just gonna talk to the dude. Should I just talk to him? You think? Um, I don't know. So let's, I mean, we can look around for a bit if you want. I'm not getting a lot of twinklies. Yeah, maybe not. No, no. Let's just, let's just Yeah, let's this. chat with the man. Let's chat with the man. We have some questions for you, Mr. Lightball. Knowledge of your theft racket. What's going on? Mr. Lightball, we're currently working two auto theft cases. Do you know anything about a car theft ring? Uh, certainly not. Oh, my God. Why would I get mixed up in a thing like that? Oh, my God. You're sweating bullets. All right, hold on. Actually. Now, no, he's, he's being he, a little. He's being shady, but he's still making eye contact. Yeah, I want to lean on him. In. I just want to lean, yeah, lean on him. I just want to lean on him. We have suspects with legitimate pink slips that were printed here, Lightfall. You better give me something before I bring the whole department down here. Don't be hysterical, detective. As a matter of fact, we had a similar problem a couple of years ago. A number of used car lots were selling blank documents to a criminal organization. All right, tell us about the supply. Yeah, let's hear. Do the names Cliff Harrison and James Belasco mean anything to you? No, they do not. Goo? 
Wait. I'm gonna. Wait. He seems truthful. Lean oh, on him. No. Oh, lean yep. on him. Lean on him. <laughs> He's not lying. Lean on him. He just had to wait, and then he goes like, doubt, doubt, <laughs> doubt. Look at that. Look at his eyes. Look at his eyes. He goes like, yeah, this is totally the truth. And then he like, whoop, shady boys. <laughs> Whoa. Sorry. You're probably allergic to liars. That's probably what That's it is. <laughs> I doubt. Harrison yeah. got his car from Coombs. The pink slip looks good, and that points the finger here. Do you have any employee trouble? No, I don't. They've all been carefully screened. Look, now that I think about it, uh, <laughs> sounds familiar. Sing, Canary, sing. May have been involved in stolen documents in the past. <laughs> he's sorry. trying to frame Coombs. What's the matter? He's lying too much. Yeah, I just it's bullshit. You're making my partner sick. You're making me Light sick, ball? dude. I'm coming after your and children. And next time, pick a vest that matches your pants. Listen, I'm busy. You know where the door is. Oh, hey, hey we're the cops. Dress better, and I'll answer your questions quicker. <laughs> All right. Ask him about the Coombs. You have a delivery ledger, Mr. Lightball. We would like to cross-check against the Coombs Automotive Emporium. It's a little out of the ordinary, Detective. Uh, I'm not sure I can share those sorts I of records. I am the police. Doubt. I doubt. I am the police. Lean on that. He's I am the police. You don't want us having bad thoughts about you, do you? Very well. But this really is irregular. Over here. Oh Take off. God. Take off. Run. Run so we can shoot you. Five hidden vehicles? We just unlocked five hidden vehicles? What does that mean? I don't know. No. No, no. We're still, we're still looking snazzy. All right. All right. All right. Look for patterns, recurring names, unusual addresses, anything out of the ordinary. Okay. Uh. Bigelow. Bigelow. Oh, yeah. Bigelow. There we down, go. Down, 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 down. You certainly encourage repeat business, Lightbulb. This Mr. Bigelow is a good customer. Sorry to bother you, sir. We'll let you know if there are any developments. What? We have one more place to go. Is that really it? Yeah, we have two instances where Bigelow is there. Three, four, four instances. The Wright brothers? There's so many at 58 Industrial. Oh, yeah. That's where we're going. Okay. It's weird that we're just like, see ya. That's it? That's all he has to share with me? That's it. All right. Let's go be cops. What does it mean? Let's five go be vehicles. cops. Let's go be some cops. What do you think five hidden Let's vehicles Let's go be means? the cops. You're Let's get, the wheel. Let's keep being uh, the cops. Where are we going? It's still telling me that there's stuff to do here. Is there? Is there? I don't know. Should we go back inside and look? Doesn't it right, doesn't it usually cross it off the list? Yeah. What about you? Okay, <gasps> Sorry, okay. Pal. He's had enough. All oh. right. I don't know what happened there. I just pressed Can you talk to him again? Well, I trust you've got all that you need. Huh. Is this still making that noise? I don't know. I is there something I'm supposed to recognize? Is there something else I'm supposed to recognize? I don't know. Oliver, C Howison, we... Goldman, CP Lawrence. Click on the uh, address. No, I already did that. Hmm. Doesn't he, doesn't he usually cross it off? Is there anything behind the desk? Can you go behind the desk or anything? Uh... Time clock... You think I could just walk behind the desk? Yeah, why not? Doesn't seem like oh, unless I can go in here. No, it's weird that he's not checking it off, right? I'm I not. think we're fine. All right, whatever. All right. You can drive. Bigelow. And where exactly are we going? Yeah. All right, let's go. I don't feel good about that. I feel like we missed something. Yeah, me too. This is uh, some pretty intense music. A 
That doesn't bode well for me. I wonder what kind of guns I have. So it said, wait, what did it say? It says I can get guns out of the trunk? Yeah. I feel like this is gonna be a shootout. Am I crazy? No. They're already, look, they're oh, already. Oh, dude, we're already there. At least I'm gonna look good for this shootout. I thought you Marines were gung ho, Cole. You have a 45, don't you ever want to use it? I'll take the back. Just give me a few seconds to get around there. You peer pressuring me into like going into a firefight alone? Alright. So, is it true that I should be looking for like. like non violent ways out of this? Like, like, should I be like trying to like do the equivalent of like not shooting the guys? I don't know. Cole Phelps, you can try. LAPD. All of you are coming downtown with me. Oh, wow. Wow. Okay. Should I just I guess we gotta kill him, yeah. One down. Alright, make way inside. Okay. Run inside. And take cover. Oh my god. Okay. Why won't you go fucking down? Throw out the guns. Dang. One. Okay, another one down. <gasps> Wait. What? Alex. What? Uh, like. Can you like look in the view? Like look, look to your right. What? See the engine block? Right there. Fucking shoot it. Take it down. This? Yeah. Oh my. <laughs> Oh, we didn't get anyone. Yeah! <laughs> <We're> <laughs> <an> achievement! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, what the f God damn it. Alright, All right. nobody died? No, you're doing great. Oh, God, no. How long do you think you can hold out? There's so many dudes. Take your time, you're fine. Alright. Is that my guy? Yeah, he's your, your team. Got him. Up out, bitch. Where's he shooting at me from? There he is. God. Woo! <laughs> Woo! He ain't gonna be an L1R2. Alright. Alright, where is he? You see him? No. Yeah, there oh, he there is. he is. Headshot. Headshot. Come on, pop your head up. Got him. Oh! I right, follow him. Let's clear the top floor. I don't want to get drilled in the back on the way out. You're right. You're right. You're right. Oh. Oh. Oof. Oh my God. Just walk up. Walk up. Yo. Is that guy down? No. Got him. Shotgun. How do I Can change? You grab it. Yes. Oh my God. Okay. Hi. Okay. Oh. All right. All right. Don't shoot. Keep your hands up. Don't Watch shoot, he guy. said. He doesn't move I'm not gonna shoot him. This place. He's gonna go <gasps> Okay, so we heard some chimes. Yeah. Pick that up. What do we got? Delivery Gordon note. Marquee Printing Company. <laughs> There's nothing like going direct to the source. Okay. Okay. What's this? Bedding slips. Bedding slips. Looks like Mr. Lightfall has been on a Oh, street. Lightfall has been covering his gambling debts? Yeah. Hey, Santa Anita's right by my house. There's just something else in this room. Let's go look around. <sighs> I just, just... Did I just drop my gun? No. Oh, the box right there. Yeah. Okay. Dude, there enough slips here to keep them stealing cars till Christmas. From Marky Printing. Oh my gosh. Okay. We've got a trail of pink slips and stolen. Racing cars for pinks. Right to your door, Bigelow. Dude, we got like here five achievements. Back. Yeah, we crushed it. Man in charge. Make it easy on yourself. Give him up. I do work on cars for customers. You charge in here, shooting up the place like it's the ballot of bulge. I can't give you anything. Oh my God, you're gonna get rocked. In oh this my question. God, let's go. You can make this easier on yourself by giving us your man on the inside. I sometimes repair cars and put them back on the road. I need a pink slip to resell them. There's no problem there. So... 
<laughs> okay. He's literally like, Gah. okay. <laughs> Come we're, on. We're the cops. Come on. I'm telling the truth here. Come on. What are you talking about? Come on. Don't be crazy. I, I think he's full of doubt. Because yeah. if, we, if we're looking at it. Yeah. Yeah. Men in this warehouse. A couple more. Punks won't make for that much extra paperwork. We'd be doing the legal system a favor. Okay. Okay. Tough guy. I get the message. Lightfall. The guy who runs Marquis. He's the big shot. He likes to spend big at the track. He owes people. Okay. Oh. Tell us about your association there, buddy. Bike ball. The guy with no luck at the track. Tell me about him. Uh. One of the guys lying over there. Full right. of shit. No luck. You are full of shit. <laughs> Should I lie, right? He's lying. We have the fucking yeah. note. I just talked to the dude. We are a fucking idiot. That's the best lie you can come up with, Bigelow. Hey, would I lie to you, detective? I'm not exactly in a good position here now, am I? Um, the the, the uh, delivery ledger, I think, will do it right. The thing that has his name on it, delivery note, delivery to Stephen Bigelow, signed off by Gordon Lightvall. So e okay, it's either it's either the ledger or the note. Which one you think? I don't know. Which one should I pick? Well, let's do the note because the note has his name on. The note we know. Did we just signed off by 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 Levitoff? Should I back out of this? Do we think it's. No, I, th I think, let's do, do the note. The note. All right. Gordon Lightball owns Marquee Printing. Yeah, okay. Print just shop. the fact that he's the owner is the evidence. The I just track. talked to him. He has these big government contracts. Oh, thank God. That was and tough. <laughs> Feds find out. Okay. Contracts will be all over. Damn. Lightball plays ball. I cannot believe how right, good we're doing. <laughs> Play your cards right, and you'll be able to count your time in Quentin on one hand. Hell yeah. They can be my hidden vehicles, whatever those may be. Dude, you're getting rocked, city. Look at that. Look at that. We are the best. Cleaning up oh, the streets. Oh, now we gotta go get Gordon. Now we gotta go arrest boss for, man. For the record, Gordon's been my least favorite character we've encountered so far. You hate At least man? in this case. What's going on He's over just, here? We, we murdered like six straight. dudes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Can you drive to this one? Oh, that's why we're not done with it. Because we got to go arrest that mug. Spoiler. We're coming back for you, bish. <laughs> How's that a spoiler? Spoiler, bish. We're coming for spoiler, you. Spoiler, bish. Get out of the way. We are on police business. Oh, uh, gonna take some cleaning up, that's for sure. I wish it hadn't gone that way. Well, we shouldn't bring guns to work with them. We didn't have a lot of choice. You have to admire the bare face. I murdered everyone in there. Brains out one minute and pleads innocence. The I next. just killed like yeah. eight dudes. Especially when he's surrounded by evidence. <laughs> so guys like Bigelow spend so much time convincing themselves that they're not doing anything wrong. They start to believe they it. They actually start to believe their own bullshit. They get sloppy. Bigelow, Lightball, all of them. Yeah. And who knows how long they could have kept this racket going. Complacency or greed. It's always Dude, one it was of so easy to be a criminal in the 40s. I like <laughs> I want to know if these cases are real. Like, there's got to be some real stuff to this, right? I'm sure that they're based off like notes and research from the actual LAPD. They yeah, that'd be, be that'd be tight. Because like they went through so much trouble to make the city exactly how it I'm was. Gonna, I'm gonna look this up. See this thing on the wiki page. Okay. Well, wait. Before we do that, let's let's handle this. Oh yeah, sorry. I'm don't want to spoil it. Okay. Let's. Take you to prison. Should I? Nah, man. We don't need no guns. You don't think? Nah. I guess I always have my pistol on me. That's true. You're under arrest. You again? This harassment is starting to wear thin. What do you? Th Why do you think I came back here, bro? Why do you think we I? found a box of pink slips in a <laughs> warehouse full of hot cars. You signed for them, light bulb. I signed for all the orders and deliveries. Oh my god. You'll need something better than that, cowboy. Oh yeah? From who? Oh yeah? You're full of shit. You fucking liar. Liar? What Hold on, okay. <laughs> we have fucking evidence that he's betting. Gambling debts. The gambling debts. Okay, we're gonna come at him with the gambling debts, right? Save it, Lightball. We already have all we need to send you down. I've had enough of this. You either produce some shred of proof, or I call my attorney. 
Okay. The gambling debts. The betting slips or the gambling debts? I th it, either or. He's tied to both of them. Okay. You're in the hole with the organization. We know about the debts, Lightfall. I agree. I have a small problem. We called you out! I'm prepared to help you in any way I can, Detective. Yeah! I'll name names. You are roasted. I need you to keep this out of the paper. You are roasted. Need you need to shut up now, Lightball. Gordon Lightball, I'm trying to. Oh my you god. Conspiracy Look at this. <laughs> Look at this. Daps. Daps for days. Daps for days. Daps for hashtag four days. Super Beer Brothers cracked the, the case LAPD yet again. The Central Traffic Division has today smashed a nationwide auto theft ring, writes crime correspondent, blah, blah, blah. Oh, here it is. Traffic squad detectives confronted a large group of armed thugs. Damn After right we did. Exchange of gunfire. More than a dozen dead criminals were removed from the scene. Damn right. The LAPD sustained no casualties. You're damn right I didn't. Damn Hell yeah. Look at this goddamn suit. Helps. Yeah. Now get out there and nail some more bad guys, will you? I want to finish reading this. God damn it, I'm the best police officer there ever was. <laughs> so after... Um, no one is safe. I, I, while we were just kind of getting that down... <sighs> I'm sorry. <sighs> I'm sorry. That's not too bad. Is that... Is that a perfect hundo percento out of that? You're right, it is. You found all those clues and the correct questions? They didn't give us a crappy, uh... Like, you should have done this in the case notes also. Yeah. Like, last time it was like, you could have gone back to the house if you wanted. S oh. The printer's devil. That's a gold trophy. Dude. Hell Yeah. So I, I while 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 we were wrapping up the scene, I did some research. Okay. Um, there's not too much involving this case in terms of like Real what's time. there. Um, there's a, a couple of notes we can talk about. So uh, the ending in this particular case all depends on Phelps. Okay. Um, oh, we got signed out of PSN. And how he handles the deliveries to the industrials to the industrial street question correctly. If he does it right, Leary will be very bright from the good press. And praise Phelps from his work, which we did. But if Phelps doesn't handle it right, Leary will angrily relate both of them. Mostly Phelps. Like, he'll just be like, what the hell? He's like, "What? how you represent the fucking LAPD this way, you bish? Whatever. Because we're perfect dicks. Hashtag. Uh, you can free roam with guns in this case, actually. What? Like, if I just, like, walked away from the building? Yeah. I could just, like, run around in LA with guns? Yeah. That's hilarious. Well, what a great, what a great case. Another one. Another one up. down. Another criminal pulled right off the streets. What's, the, what's, the, what's our Beer next Bros. case called, Alex? Let's get a sneak preview of the next episode's case. Let's jump in. We're Let's, never going to finish this game, and I'm yes, totally we are, okay dude. with it. Yes, I'm we are, I'm having so much yes, fun. Yes, we are, dude. We're having a great time. We're going to crush this game. Oh, we got a little, little backstory going on okay. right now. All right. My family runs a shipping business in San Francisco. We used to have two ships a week to Tokyo. Phillips. We've been in shipping for two generations, Hank. I've never been on a voyage anywhere. I feel like I feel this guy's like going to just end up being Bucky. The Odyssey took <laughs> 10 years, Cole. <laughs> this is the American century. America can rule the world after we win this war. Good Lord. We need to stay alive, Cole. These men are counting on us. Have you heard what the veterans are saying to each other? No. Golden Gate in 48. That's four more hard years of fighting. We're not going to be fighting until 48. Tell you a little thing about giant atrocities, like dropping a nuclear bomb on an entire country. <laughs> Alex, spoilers for World War II? Spoilers! <laughs> yeah, you know what? Actually, you're right. I'm sorry if you haven't read that far in your history books yet, guys. The Fallen Idol! <laughs> <laughs> if you guys are working on American History 101. I didn't mean to spoil it for you. A Fallen Idol. This one looks like a movie. Uh-oh. Oh! Whoa! Oh, my gosh. Dude, I would totally watch a procedural set in the 40s. Actually, I think there was an L.A. Confidential show, wasn't there? No. Phelps, yes, there was, I think. We have a new case. Two women. Possible drink drive. How was that a case? The broad says she was doped and that somebody tried to kill her. Where did this take place? That's the bitch you're gonna love. Right across the street. What? The Chevy Style Line took a nose. Style Line, what a great name. Fetched up underneath a Cola King billboard. 
Up to it, boys. We got bad guys to catch. Huh. Hey, I gave his wife a tap. Damn, victims drugged Chevy style. See you later, fellas. Try not to work too hard. Fallen Idol, you think it's like a movie star or something? Yeah. 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 I'm just trying to fit in. You think that might be the perfect time to continue wearing this suit, or should I change my persona? It's up to you. I don't have the option. All right, folks. Question of the day. What was it? We didn't have one. Question of the day. What's the biggest? What's the biggest amount of money you've ever lost gambling? About tree fifty. Three hundred fifty dollars. Yeah. Holy shit, dude. But to be fair, I was up about two. So you were like, so you were still up two after you lost three fifty? Yeah. Was my one of my my second or third trip to Vegas? Dude, that is some. Craziness. My dad, my I, my brother taught me craps on a uh, how to play craps on a boat because uh -huh. there, there was a casino on the boat, and him and my brother-in-law taught me how to play. And then my my second trip back to Vegas, they like I just you? I just no, I went in there. You were just winning craps. True story. True story, Alex. Yeah, the completionist. I didn't have enough money to afford a camera. I could not afford a camera. <laughs> I went to my brother. And I asked for a hundred dollars, uh -huh. and he was very reluctant and gave it to me. And he was like, "I don't know what you need this for, but like." And you like, went to Vegas. And I went to Vegas, and I walked out with twenty-two hundred dollars. <laughs> the only good luck I've ever had. The only luck I've ever had. That I also is fucking crazy. I also, while in Vegas, sold my camera. I sold like my old camera. So I walked in out Las with, Vegas. Yeah, at a pawn shop. No, I, on Craigslist. Oh my god! I brought it with me. And I was like, you know, I'm in Vegas. I'm just gonna sell it and see what happens. It's an efficient trip. And I was up there, and within three hours of set of posting it, I got a guy who wanted to buy it for a church, and I sold it to him, and I got my price. Great. And then I bought all the equipment, all like the basic essential stuff. Some for of it we still use. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, now I didn't buy it for the completionist, but I bought it to like. Upgrade all of my film stuff. Right. Um, and boy, am I glad I did. I've lost about five dollars actually betting. Uh, but one time I went to like an acquaintance's birthday party. For? Yeah. That was a poker night, and I won all the chips at the party and in poker, and bought a like family heirloom plate with my tickets from the like prize corner. Oh wow. Yeah. That's the best I've ever done. That's the most gambling I've ever done. Yeah, I've gambled since then and lost a lot, but I like not know, not three hundred fifty dollars. Not like three fifty in, in one go. All right. Honestly, what happened was I didn't notice the chips from the table. That's the problem with crafts. It's crafts you throw so many chips out. Yeah. I left a large amount out and forgot about it for like twenty minutes. You just and then when through, I yeah. finally when I finally crapped out, I lost it. Jesus. All right. Well, next time we're gonna go across the street and look at that car up there. You see it up there? Yeah. Look at that Cola King. Uh, I call a king uh, ad. It's tight. Yeah. You see the car right up there? Yeah. All blue and stuff? Yeah. Shout out to the soundtrack. Uh, I'm going to probably download the soundtrack and listen to it right now when I drive when you're home. you're driving home? Yeah. It's tight. Tight. No lie, I bought the man who wasn't there on Blu-ray because I'm just hungry for the 40s. Uh, uh, all right. I'll see you guys later. Later, man. Bye.